A man convicted of first-degree murder 40 years ago is no longer getting out of prison after Governor Kevin Stead reversed his decision to grant parole. News on 6's Kristen Weaver joins us live with what the victim's family now has to say. Kristen? Well, Craig, the murder victim's twin sister, Rochelle Ruth, tells me this feels like a weight has been lifted off her shoulders, and it brings her some peace. Up until last night, Rochelle Ruth thought her sister's killer, Jimmy Stoller, would get out of prison after Governor Kevin Stitt approved a request for parole this week. I just couldn't go there. I just thought that this can't be real. Stoller was convicted of killing Michelle Powers 40 years ago. She actually was being treated and ended up dying in the hospital where she worked. Prosecutors say he planned to kill Powers for many months before he claims he paid a co-worker to shoot Powers with a crossbow. Tulsa County Prosecutor John Jeardsma says he's been urging the governor's office to not let Stoller out after the Pardon and Parole Board recommended his release. Stitt initially approved the request, but Jeardsma sent a letter clarifying the facts of the case and people urged Stitt's office to reconsider. There was a lot of public attention put on this case. Certainly, the victim's sister was very vocal. Ultimately, Stitt reversed that decision and denied parole yesterday. Rochelle says it's like a weight off her shoulders. I do have a peace uh, right now. I won't have to worry about going to Tulsa and maybe running into a killer. Now, Rochelle tells me she's thankful this chapter is over and appreciates the Tulsa County DA's office. Stoller will be eligible again for parole in a couple of years. Kristen Weaver, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.